I can't believe that Kentaro went down. He was in good shape and then he was dead. I'm guessing ammo explosion. Um, we can't get anything here because we don't have any salvage. Um, I did 701. I took 383. Yeah, he, he just got cored out. Look at that. He doesn't really have any damage at all. Um, he only took 220. Awesome took 231. I took 383. Trebuchet really hasn't taken any, but he also, well, he did almost as much. The Gintaro was poor. Give me just a second. Jello. It's a doggy door. You just push open. Hey. All right, so yeah, um, I took 643,000 points of damage there, and we're not getting paid for that. Um, contract is still available. Contract is still available. Can we repair here? Oh, it's not even going to let us. It's not even going to let us repair at all. Oh, that's new. This is definitely a patch. Okay, star map. Where can we go to repair? Um, nowhere? I don't see any... Okay, there's one. Have anything closer? No, we've got nothing even remotely close to us. This is going to be a pain in the ass. So that's four jumps. That's three jumps. All right. I'm going to say patch, um, patch confirmed, even though nothing anywhere says it happened. Rare mech for sale. Oh, a catapult. An A1. Mm. I think actually it's probably a lot better than I thought it was after our experiments. Because I think he'll sit back, he'll LRM. If something gets close, he's not going to be able to do damage to it anymore, so he won't be able to hang on to the hate, onto the aggro. And uh, something else will grab him. And because he sits back, he's not going to have a lot of damage, so he's not going to go up the hate list based on damage either. Um, he's in good shape. Barracks wise, do they have any pilots? Oh, our, our, uh, Freeman's injured. Ready for action. Nice drop ship, but boring as hell. Nothing we, nothing we don't better than what we have. All right, let's go ahead, and now we can do our repairs. Um, you're fine. So it wouldn't even let us repair now. Wow, that's a huge change. Um, and we lost PPC. I lost heat sinks. Okay, well, all of a sudden, Phillips' uh, belief that we need to. Uh, bail out every time is well we're not gonna have a choice I mean, that's really what it comes down to we have to now uh, you have to have extra mechs if you want to stay in system we're going to do those um, PPC wise what do we have we got three of well yeah I mean one thing we were talking about in chat was um, in the comments was whether we should be taking heat sinks as salvage. So a heat sink for us to buy at the moment is how much? 3,000. So we're paying 3,000. So if we can take something else that gives us more than 3,000, it's worth it to just buy them and not bother. Now they don't always have a lot of them around, but And I don't want heat sinks. I don't know how I keep ending up with heat sinks in the arms. I don't want heat sinks in the arms. It makes no sense to me. And yet somehow I always have heat sinks in the arms. Cello, stop being stupid. Look, look right here. I'm dog sitting a miniature schnauzer who is he hates cats, and I have a cat who happens to be 16 years old, 
and she doesn't feel like she should have to put up with dealing with him. So she's essentially living <laughs> here in this room more or less full time. And then there's a, a gate out there to keep him from getting in here. Um, so she can't go in and out the normal doggy door like she used to, which is out in the kitchen because um, she'd have to make a run past him and then she'd have to be in the yard with him to get out. So she's her ingress and egress is a bedroom window right now. And uh, I built a kitty door insert that goes in the window so she can I don't have to leave the window open. It's January, for God's sakes. Right. Um, and she just refuses to use it. She just scratches next to it to go in and out. She won't. She knows full well how to use a doggy door. She's been using this one for. I don't know, five, six years now. She's had them in other houses too. She just she just doesn't want to use this one. She's just being stubborn. All right, so back on topic here. Um, oh man, this uh, the Warhammer has been horrible for us. I think I I think we can all agree we have not had the greatest luck with the Warhammer. I think I'm getting better with it. Um, but when things go wrong, they go wrong quickly. Um, I can't repair the Warhammer. Or the awesome. Why not? I, oh, because I already am. Because I'm an idiot. That's why. All right. Let's take a look at this. Again, he just got cored. Heat, do we think? I think heat. I think he killed himself. I think he killed himself. I think what we need to do... I think we either need to drop to three sixes or four fours. So four fours is 16, three sixes is 18. And then we use the extra weight to put more heat sinks on. And I'm gonna take away the medium lasers too. I think he just blew himself up. I think this is purely a heat management issue. Head and torso, right? That's what we're going to see if we see somebody overheat. I should do it once just to verify. I have actually done it once in a co-op, um, but I don't remember. It wasn't my game, and it, it was pre-patch when I couldn't repair stuff. So I don't actually know what the damage looked like. Um, so I'm going to go three sixes for the moment. Yeah, I don't think I have four fours. We'll do that. We'll repair all. And then we're going to add some heat sinks. Just kind of put them everywhere. <laughs> uh, except the arms. Uh, and I don't want any in. I'll put some in a leg. Put some in a leg. We'll try that. Um, one more. How about one up there? Um, that gives us 0 0.3, and our overall heat is down by a chunk. So before, our heat was uh, 3.6, 7.2, um, another 5. Like 12.3 plus the medium lasers. Three, 17.3. Now we could put some smalls out there just to give them something. They do much less heat, 0.75 versus 2.25. Let's do that. Let's give them a little bit back. But I think he's just blown himself up in this thing. And then that just hoses us. Just absolutely hoses us. You know what? No, we already got heat sinks in. We're just running this. This is it. Just three sixes. That's it. Let's go with that. Um, but I'm really not feeling that. I'd like something other than the Warhammer. Clearly, we need more weight. We don't have enough weight for what we're doing. Um, let's see if we fix the Kentaro. What does this Kentaro look like? He also is... He's two sixes at the moment and two medium lasers as well. But he's got heat sinks. I think I am. 
what's the weight? The weight on this is three. The weight on these is two. Two. So we are saving one ton by just doing three rather than that. Um, I am going to put small lasers on this one. I'm going to get rid of the mediums. I'm going to put smalls on there. Uh, and then I'm going to put another heat sink on there. So the 19 has better, I think, better heat. 1.5. We'll find out here in a second. We'll see how that goes. Hmm. Do we have better medium lasers? There's no reason this guy can't have good medium lasers in the center torso. Um, no, we go through so many of them. We do have a couple two star though, so we are tier two, so we'll put those in there. AC 10, is that what we want? I don't have a whole lot else we can put in there. Fair enough. What's on the market? We can put a burst fire in. There's a tier one burst fire. I'm not sure it's worth spending 300,000 for the small upgrade. Um, anything else here I can't live without? No, but I am going to buy more SRM6s because <laughs> we need them. We go through them. Um, I am going to buy the extra heat sinks as long as we're here. I think that's all I absolutely feel like I have to have at the moment. Oops. Start work. I guess we give this thing a try again. Let's hop up over here and see what the hero mech is. I don't think we can afford it, but at this point I would sell the Warhammer. The Warhammer seems to be my most problematic mech, the most expensive mech to keep. Not necessarily the worst mech on the battlefield, but the most expensive mech to keep running. Um, the awesome honestly doesn't take much damage. Still have that. Banshee. Ah, Banshee doesn't help us. Not at 27 million, it doesn't. That's for damn sure. Um, although it is one of the few reasonable ones with some pulse lasers of PPC and AC-10 and RM-5. I don't like the fact that every single one of these is a different range. It doesn't have two of the same weapon. Um, this would be a good uh, candidate for an experiment where you put every weapon on its own firing group. One through six for the AI. Hmm. Okay. One thing I'm going to do real fast. I'm assuming this is because of the update, actually. I just now came to me. Let's go to options. Let's go to controls. Um, and let's come down here to weapon groups and let's reset these. Weapon group three. No, it doesn't see the button at all. How about... Oh, no, this one is this. Nope, it doesn't see either of those buttons. I wonder if they're dead. I think my mouse is dead. I'm missing, uh, it's supposed to be able to increase and decrease the speed too with the little, little buttons here. There's no light there. Let me check to make sure it's plugged in. This is a weird episode, guys. I'm sorry. I 
I plugged it in, unplugged it and plugged it back in. Let's try it again. Hmm. You know, it's funny. I use Zoom. I use the mouse wheel for Zoom. I wonder if I could use it for Fire Group 3, Fire Group 4. So you can see mouse wheel up, mouse wheel down there. What happens if I kill that for the moment? I go cycle zoom is on Z. And I go... Nope, it won't let me do it. Well, let me fix these now. Nope. Interesting. You can... We're going to... Uh... That's fine. I can live with it for now. I'll fix it later. It's enough screwing around. Um, yes, I don't know what was wrong with the mouse, but we'll go with it. Resume. Okay. Um, so nothing here I don't think that we want. Certainly not a Banshee. I don't think either of those helps us either. So I guess we give this mission again another try. Um, I don't know that that's going to matter. But we'll run back. We'll see what happens. The question is, do I stick with my Warhammer or do I take over one of the Kentaros? I kind of just want to make sure we're covered. <laughs> is that wrong of me? I really like to not die here. I'm kind of thinking. All right, this is what I'm thinking. This is what I'm thinking. First of all, let's clear everything here. If I take, is he not? Oh, he's two tons under. Why is he two tons under? Do we miss heat sinks? And I can't do anything about it here. God darn it. Darn it all the heck. Okay. Well, is what it is. Um, if I take the awesome. And then. We take the trebuchet. Then we put Kentaros down here, just because they have the most firepower. We could uh, AC5, SRM6. No, we're going to go with both of these, the 18 and the 19. The 18 has cooling of 1.4. The 19 has cooling of 1.5, despite the extra missiles and the smalls. We did downgrade the smalls. Um, double heat sinks on that one, maybe? Is that what the deal is? I don't remember. Um, now, we need our best heat pilot on this one. Five, five, four, five, four. So Freeman is one of the better ones. It could be either of these guys. Um, I'm going to go with... I'll stick with Freeman. We'll put Ing on this one. Because Ingman has five and a six as well, almost a seven. Let's finish that seven up. We're all missiles is the problem right now. And we only really have two good missile pilots. Um, Henson's got a four. So we'll go with that for our third pilot. Is that how I want to do it? Whoops. I mean, we could conceivably also just say I'm the LRM. And we could go with we could go with the the Warhammer. Does that change the pilot we want? So we've got Henson and we've got Ferris. Ferris is a two, he's a five. Yeah, I think Henson is more suited to this. Let's give him this one. That puts us at 260. We're close. I think we've done a better job of matching pilots to mechs. Hopefully we fix the heat issues of this. 
if he doesn't blow himself up, I think we're in a better spot. Um, I'm probably going to post something similar. These guys slightly closer, maybe him up on the hill, not too far behind them, and me on the hill the other side of them. Something along those lines, I think. And we'll see if we can get it done this time. Man, there's a lot of failure lately. A lot of failure. A battalion of Liao troops is planning on using this planet as the tip of the spear for an assault More on than Davion I am strictly territory. comfortable with. The Davion forces are scrambling to get here. Okay. So it'll be up to us I'm gonna to hold say, back and divert the initial landing party while they make their way to this planet. F2, F3. And hold tight. F3, F3. Repositioning. F4, F3. Right. Holding an app point. Top point reached. And LRMs are three for me on this one. And then I'm gonna set up here, I think. This might be a little slow, guys, but we did just fail last time. So I think slow and steady wins the race here. Target acquired. Nope. Wanna get the target again? Keep the target long enough to get a hit on something. I think we, oh, yeah, we did. He's coming back around. He's scored CT. We could finish him with LRMs. I can't use the mouse wheel. <laughs> I think PPC got him. See, can we get some shots here? Is he too close to the mountain? I think we put that PPC shot through his leg. And he's out of range. Um, do you have a chopper coming in? Is that ours or theirs? We move forward. I... Okay. This guy's gotta come back in. That's our helicopter. Within 19, and now that we can actually see him, I lost the target. Nice. Not quite sure why we lost the target when we could see him, but we had it when we couldn't, but you know, whatever. He's in tough shape. He did take our helicopter, but that bastard. That man had a family. We might blow through all our LRMs here. I'm gonna move forward a little bit. He looks like he's coming forward on his own. I'm gonna start backing up. All right, you guys stay where you're at. I'm going to get back out of my zoom. I'm gonna come up. I think we only need to get to be out 200 here to set this thing off. And then I'm gonna run like hell back to my hill. And we will see how it goes. Said 200, you right? Your presence, Commander. I'm seeing multiple tangos on score converging on your current position. They are right on top of us, aren't they? Okay, well, let's spin around. Dude. Target Let's get some LRMs on him. This will be my most reliable. Oh, I just completely whipped that. Hit him? Yeah. All right. He's going to be easier to hit, just period. Bigger target. Why did we lose the target there? I don't understand that. Sometimes the targeting on this... Target 
Destroy. Target acquired. Got him. All right, how are we doing? We're in decent shape. Ooh, okay. Then dropping on top of me was unexpected. Unexpected, but we've come out of it okay. Target acquired. Uh, yep. I'm just gonna put this in, or not. Again, I'm not quite sure how we lost that. But what else do we have in there? Uh, Shadowhawk is gonna be a pain. Uh, he's the easiest to kill. Second drop. This will be our tanks and stuff. Hopefully, we didn't lose all our missiles against the side of the leopard there. All right. I might have to change who I'm targeting here. He's out of range anyway at the moment, I think. Uh, I mean, the urban mech. He's not not a threat at the moment. Let's see if we can. Uh, yeah, somebody got his leg and it caused me to miss everything because I did not adjust well for it. Oh, hopefully I didn't hit our own dude there. Uh, and I'm out at I'm out of LRMs. Oh, hey, buddy, don't move. <laughs> this is surgical here. We'll see what we can do now with the uh, PPCs. One down. All right, get out of the way. The guy doing going critical. We'll see if my PPCs are getting any better. Got it. Not me, but somebody. Shoot through the trees there. Uh, he's just on the other side of that. Thing. He's almost dead. Uh, I don't want to shoot my own guy. There we go. He came clear. Nice. One more tank coming in. Uh, don't worry about me, Kintaro. You're okay. You're okay. Freeman blew himself up again, it looks like. Uh, and Aang's not doing too much better. We are probably not going to survive this again. I don't know what's going on with Ing, but uh, I think we need to rethink our lance composition dramatically, dramatically, especially in light of the new patch requirements. I'm going to start moving now. Um, now that they're targeting me. Side, which I can't really hit. We'll just kill him. Shoot me with machine guns. Is that our own? Coming this way. Now I'm gonna back up and just bring this guy with with me to our dude. There we go. Um actually it needs more ammo, but other than that. The awesome. The Warhammer's in perfect condition. Oh, this is not good. Balin.
All right. I think what has to happen is we have to go back to doing lower level missions. We have to build up and change dramatically our lance composition. Um, we could get around with me screwing around before, but if the new requirements are going to be, we have to leave the system every time we do a fight like that. We got, we got nothing. We got 227,000 for that. And they both cord themselves out. They are both incapable of handling this type of mech. Despite having a five. Let's, let's go somewhere and see what the damage looks like. We expect to see no head and no torso. That for us is what we believe is a overheat kill. Um, and that might be a patch issue, right? That We haven't been seeing this before. Um, so are they hitting override and doing it? After the last patch, there was an issue with some people seeing the fire starters turning on their override uh, and blowing themselves up without players pushing buttons um, in co-op. So I don't know. I'm going to go star map. Where was our closest system? Gallot's in. Let's pop up here. This has really hurt us money-wise. This is really, really bad. Because we're nowhere near finishing that mission. Uh, and if both of our Kentaros are going to blow themselves up every time we run, um, we're going to have to rethink how we play this game. Um, fairly strongly. So I'm going to go in here. Let's take a look at Kentaro. No head, no torso. Overheated himself. These aren't ammo explosions. Our ammo is just fine. Same thing here. Head, torso gone. He overheated. Um, wow. I'm not really sure how I want to adjust to this. Uh, if they're incapable of managing their own heat at this point, and that, that's what this is. I mean, this is purely that. Um, do we do like two SRM6s? Maybe I drop a ton of ammo. Maybe two medium lasers. And that's it? Is that all we can really afford to run with? And then heat sinks? Uh, repair all. Something like that? I mean, I just... I don't know what to do at the moment with no patch notes. <laughs> As the time I'm doing this. In fact, no indication that they've patched at all. No notice at all. Um, uh, and again, all of our ammo is fine. This wasn't an ammo explosion. This was an overheat. Um, despite the fact he'd already lost an arm and lost both SRM4s when it happened. Uh, wow, I'm not sure I have enough heat sinks left to rebuild this sucker. Uh, good thing I bought some SRM6s though, huh? <laughs> Uh, that one's in reasonable shape. Um, and then we're going to do mediums. We expect to lose these, but we'll, we'll put them in while we have them. I'm going to move this out of the arm. I don't think I did it in the last one, but we'll do it here. Um, heat sink wise, we'll put one there. Uh, repair all. We have a lot of extra weight on this. It just feels bad not to... Do something. Do we think we can get away with two SRM sixes and SRM four, or maybe one six and two fours? I'm wondering if we drop the six here. And we go a four here and a four here. With heat sinks. All the ones we have. Have they replenished their heat sinks? Can we buy more? <laughs> Good. Three more. And something like that. I mean, that's a 1.7. It's slightly better. We're not doing three sixes. We're doing a six and two fours. 2.5 versus 3.6. Um, so we brought it down by two there. We are running mediums, which 
our more. Um, what is our weapon groups like? That might be part of it. What if we do that? That way he's never firing all of them at once. Will that help force him to be better? I'm fine. He was fine as uh, well. He lost. Oh, he was underweight because we gypped him a couple heat sinks, I think. We have machine gun ammo. We have machine gun ammo. We've got SRM ammo. I'm kind of thinking of taking the SRM off. I do use them when we're in close, but I think we're more likely to want just an LRM there and use it a little bit like I'm using the awesome two PPCs LRMs from long range. The only difference is that this has a close range context to it when they get close. So we could go, how much tonnage do we have? We've got six tons without ammo. That's five tons. So we could put an SRM 10 or an LRM 10, one ton, just one at the moment of ammo in there. That gives us two PPCs in the LRM-10 at range. That's going to be 44 shots with the LRM. Let's try that. That gives us two backliners. God knows with these, we may have to go down to running just the Centurion and the Wolverine if heat's going to be an issue. I mean, they both have an SRM. They both have an AC-10. Oh, AC-5 versus AT-10. Uh, two medium lasers versus one. Let's check the barracks. Make sure there's nobody really good here that we just can't live without. There is not. Market-wise, we didn't see... A Jaeger wouldn't be bad. Thunderbolt would be really good, actually. Um, I don't have the money for it. But I think it's a step up from a lot of what we have. We could sell the Jenner. Jenner's not helping us much here. If we do decide to go down and do some lower level missions, We've still got some 50s, some 55s. We can drop down to 2, 210 drop weight really easily with what we have without having any problems. So I think we do. I think I'm going to try to sell the Jenner. Let's see what we can do equipment-wise before we sell anything else. Let's look at this. I've got one bad 10, two of those, and a burst fire. So I'll sell that. Um, AC2s, I'm not even using anything on them. I'll sell those. I'll sell the bad burst fires. I've got three AC-20s. We'll keep the tier ones, we'll sell the others. I've got two AC-20 tier four burst fires. I'm gonna sell one more of those. And two regular burst fires. I'll sell those. Um, two AC-5s. My cat's of course being a pain in the ass again. Those are tier zero, so we'll sell them. I don't use flamers at all. I might have to rethink that, the way things are going. Um, but we'll sell them for now. Am I really down to one, one point? We're not buying a mech. I didn't realize how little money we had. Um, I'm buying crap. Oh, God damn it. Okay, never mind. That's a problem. We just bought a bunch of crap. On the wrong one. Well, that hurts. <laughs> uh, well, we lost money on that exchange. Uh, I probably don't need seven of those. Let's knock it down a couple. Um, I got two, I got 15. 
We'll knock it down to 10. That gives us 12 medium lasers plus the two pulses. We've got some PPCs. Um, medium, smalls, SRM4s and 6s. Um, we'll hang on to those. Clearly, we need. I'll sell this one. Um, ammo, ammo. I'm not going to sell the jump jets yet because this patch might have fixed jump jets. I don't really have anything else to sell. Um, we are not, repeat, not going to have enough money to buy a Thunderbolt regardless now. 1.5 would get us 4.5. Um, oh, I take it back. Yes, we can. Um, we do owe a lot of money very soon. So if we sell the Jenner... Do I have anything in cold storage? I don't, do I? No. If we were to sell the Jenner... My cat is standing right in front of her cat door and scratching next to it. Rather than just moving her foot over a tiny bit, if she were to scratch on the door, it'd move. <laughs> um... Okay. Uh, what type of shape is this Thunderbolt in? It's actually in really good shape. Um, so if we buy this, that's going to leave us about 700000 But we are going to owe 400000 in 71 days, plus we need to travel somewhere. So we have to make money. And it needs to be repaired. Just repaired, though. I'm not... Let's take a look at the edit and see if we really... I'm going to get rid of the SRM-2. I think SRM-2s are a complete waste of everything. Um, large laser, LRM-15. I'm just going to max armor. Yeah, actually, he's already maxed armor, isn't he? So just maybe some heat sinks? My cat is being a complete pain in the ass. She's just sitting there scratching away. She'll do it all day. We'll start that. All right. Um, next episode, hopefully we have patch notes and we go back and we try to rebuild um, some money. I'm not quite sure how far back we go at the moment. We are a tier eight. Maybe we go back to a tier six or seven uh, and we just knock some out. We could probably do regular tier eights too. This one is just kicking my butt. Um, let's do home view log. Does it tell us what the... Man, there's just such good rewards for it, though. That's what's killing me. Um, anyway, we'll figure it out next time. Thanks for watching, guys. Thumbs up, thumbs down. Don't forget to subscribe. If you're playing the game, make sure you check for patch notes. Um, see if they're out yet. And we'll see you guys next time. Cheers.